They couldn't do anything about the fountain, but inside the Ottawa Conference Centre, the Green Party shut the escalators down to conserve energy. The Greens' new leader says their core message is about the environment, but they must offer Canadians much more. We have a job ahead of us to make it a lot easier to elect Green MPs and to see our policies in practice across Canada. The former executive director of the Sierra Club, May, is a well-known advocate. There is no left or right on a dead planet. She took the vote with more than 60% at a time Greens say is critical for the party. We are right now at our breakthrough stage. And their numbers are promising. Last election, they took 4.5% of the vote. A total of more than 640,000 Canadians voted for them. But so far, the only number that counts, no seats. But the party says this convention will change all that. So which party leader should be worried about all of this? Well, Elizabeth May says they all should be. She also offers up her platform and will gladly hand it over to any party if it means change. They can steal your ideas if they want. I want them to steal our ideas. I want our ideas to take off with a momentum that's unstoppable. The outgoing leader says that's already happening, pointing to Liberal leadership candidate Michael Ignatieff's carbon tax proposal. And when you have what is the supposed leading contender of the supposed governing party taking our platform, it shows you how front and centre we are to the political debate. The Greens' last convention was held in an Alberta campsite with a new leader not shy about media attention and more money. They've come a long way in what could be a breakthrough political season for the party. Graham Richardson, CTV News, Ottawa.